But the union makes us strong. There seems to be no end soon to the healthcare workers' national strike that entered its second day of the second month. If remarks by the unionists are anything to go by. Everything that we have presented to the government in our strike notice are all of them achievable. And in any case, one way or the other, they are in their own blueprints. Now, if they are not willing to implement what they promised Kenyan to enhance services, we want to say categorically that uh, we are not going to relent. At a joint conference, the health unions say talks between them and the government, led by the head of public service, Felix Koskei, to end the strike collapsed last month and that they have since then not received any official invitation by the government to resume the talks. Chair of the Health Committee, the Council of Governors, he knows the procedure. He knows that this is a collective bargaining agreement, that if it is to be varied, there has to be a meeting, there has to be discussions. It's not a unilateral decision to be done. And therefore, they can't keep on saying that we are ready for engagement on the media, or on the funerals, or in political rallies, when you're not seeing any letter of that matter. The other thing is, I think today we, are, we were invited by the CS Labour to discuss how to bring the government back on table because government has been on strike. They walked out of a negotiation and you, you walk out of negotiation when you have no plans to implement the issues that have been pre presented before you. We have a court order of 8th November 2023 directing them to come to the table. A conciliation committee of three conciliators was put in place. They never appeared. They say that the government has instead resorted to threats with the latest one from the Inspector General of Police, Jafit Kome, against the democratic right to picket. Our demonstrations have always been peaceful and we have presented petitions. And this is not going to change because of the threats, because of victimization. And tomorrow, 16th Tuesday, we will be on the streets as per the Article 37. Yes. We will not be covered and we will do what we want under the Constitution. The health unions are now planning to hold what they term as a mega assembly Wednesday, during which they will mobilize medical specialists from the private sector to support their cause. Kamchimenza for Prime Edition.